What's up sports to the bone family? What's up? What's up? Alright, my viewers and subscribers. So the time is now, the place is here. West Indies versus Bangladesh, second test match of the series. West Indies looking to try and sweep this series 2-0. Yes, man, we, we secured victory in the first test quite convincingly. Think we won um that test match. Uh you know, we 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 actually had an entire day to spare, a day and probably a half. A day and a half to spare so that is history we are going into this second test match here now and i i am going to be talking about the the, the 11 yeah man we, we're going to talk about the 11 you know we 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 heard uh, i think it was yesterday or the day before west indies uh you know cwi saying that they are not going to be changing the squad so we we don't have anybody outside of the squad coming in uh, we, 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 however, have uh, the lights of Anderson Philip and Devon Thomas if we want to change up the starting 11. Right? We also see, know that uh, Lewis and Tejner and Shandopal are reserve players. So, going into this, um, going into this second test match here, I, I don't necessarily really want to change anything. I really wanted to see Devon Thomas get a go. But um, you know, I, I I am I am going to give Re, uh, Raymond Reef another go at it. You know, I'm not going to use the two test match to um, two test matches to, to to drop him and to do away with him. You know, he didn't perform as well as I would have wanted him to. But um, I'm going to go with him again. I mean, I am not happy about him batting at number three. You understand? I I am not happy about him. I am not happy with him batting at number three. But at the end of the day, based on how the, the, the squad is situated, you know, um, that, that is probably where it's going to have to bat. I don't know if I want to move Nkuma Banner to three, maybe Kyle Mayers to four, and, um, you know, ask uh, our, our vice captain Blackwood to bat at five, and then Riemann Reef at six. Then Joshua De Silva or Joshua De Silva then remember. I don't know. I don't know viewers. I, I am not used to having so many all rounders in my test team. You know, I'm looking I'm playing around with um Kyle Mears and um <clears throat> Raymond Reefer because I don't really like the idea of him batting at number three. But I definitely not going to drop him um as yet. I you know want to give him another two innings to see how he go. Uh the issue though is that Tejner and Shandopal and Devon Thomas, those are two guys that I wanted to see in this test series before we move into another test series. But anyway, let, let me give you. So we're going to go um, John Campbell, who has, you know, he has probably secured his spot in the team for the next um, six and a half years with that, uh, what was it, 58 that he got, um, not out also. So John Campbell is going to be there again. I remember on the live show, we had, a, uh, I think it was one person that was saying that they would probably... Um, open with Tejnar and Shandopal and Brathwit and put um, Brendan um, put um, John Campbell at three. I don't remember who was saying it, but I'm not gonna go there. I'm going Brathwit John Campbell to open once again. Uh, uh, I, I, as I don't really like moving players around, especially when they are not um, in good form. But in order to facilitate the same starting eleven. And remember guys, this is my 11, so you can you can disagree or agree. So in order to facilitate the same 11, I would probably shuffle the pack a little bit. So I'm going to have um, John Campbell, Brathwaite, uh, Nkuma, Bonner. I'm going to ask him to bat at number 3. I know I know he's not in good form. I know, I know guys. I know um, we probably don't want to have John Cam um, Brathwaite and, and Bonner batting together too early if Campbell gets out. But... To facilitate the, the same 11, I'm going to have Banner at 3. At 4, we're probably going to go Kyle Mayers. Right? At 5, we're going to have John. Um, at 5, we're going to have Jermaine Blackwood. At 6, that is where we're going to probably have Raymond Reefa. At 7, we have um, Joshua De Silva. And depending on if we bat our ball, for, ball first, if we if we bat first, I'll, I will probably ask if we if we bat first, I'll probably ask Joshua De Silva to bat at six and 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 have the all rounder um, Riemann Reefer bat at seven, right? I, I just playing around with it, guys, to see how it can fit, right? Then we have um, Alzari Joseph 
uh, Goody Kishmoti, you know, we have Kemar Roach, uh, Jaden Seals, and I think that is, that is 11, if I'm not mistaken. So, Brathwaite, John Campbell, Bonner, uh, Kyle Mayers, Blackwood, uh, Raymond Reefer, Joshua De Silva, uh, Alzari Joseph, Goody Kishmoti, Jaden Seals. I am forgetting somebody. I don't know who it is, but apparently I'm leaving out Kemar Roach. I think I think I left out Kemar Roach, right? So so Kemar Roach would back before Jaden Seals. Uh, I remember on the live a couple of persons were saying that they, they, they would bat um Moti before Alzari and Roach. As much as how he hung around in the last test match, um the fact that Goody Kish um the fact that Kemar Roach and Alzari would have batted for us on a, on a couple of occasions in test match and would have done pretty well. I'm not going to put Goody Kishmoti in front of them just yet. If Alzari and Kemar Roach continues to, 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 to get out cheaply, then maybe. But the fact that Roach would have saved countless amount of test matches before us, he would have earned his spot there um, right now. And Alzari, he's more hovering on the, 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 the border line. You know, he, he has two test match half century, if I'm not mistaken. But um, he's hovering on, on the borderline, right? So I might, if he doesn't pick it up a little bit and Goody Kishmoti continues to bat well, then he might get a chance to, to go in front of Alzari. But for now, um, we, 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 we de I definitely going to have those two guys batting in front of Moti. And then it's going to be Moti, then Jaden Steele. So that is how it's looking for the starting, um, for my 11, my viewers and subscribers. As I said, my 11 doesn't necessarily... Um, you know, mean that is what uh, the, the coach and the captain will go with. Doesn't necessarily mean you have to agree with me. That is why I always leave my comment section open that you guys can go ahead and um, tell me yours. But um, going into this test match, guys, the, it, it, the, it's the same thing. We need high intensity. We need the batsmen going out scoring runs. I mean, in the in the first test match, we bowled up Bangladesh for, I think it was 103. And we went in and made something like 265. Uh, a couple of the guys, the way in which they got out, uh, they definitely won to see if they can um, better that. So that is something that we, are, that we need to look at. Uh, the bowlers, just keep it tight as usual, you know. Um, continue to bowl good line and, and good length. You know, we don't really want a lot of sharp balls. We want to see... The, the lights of Jaden Seals, Kemar Roach, Alzari Joseph making the ball dance or making the ball seem around on that pitch over there in St. Lucia. I, I, I gather that the pitch is going to be very good for bowling. You know, um, for pace bowling, Goody Kishmoti is going to probably have to dig deep. I have him in my team, so I, I have to talk about him. He's probably going to have to dig deep. Or, you know, I still have Raymond Reef or Kyle Mears. You know, especially if the pitch is, is offering any anything, Mayors is definitely going to be happy to bowl on that pitch. Um, but yeah, you know, I'm hoping that we'll be able to go and wrap things up, uh, get this one out of the way, see if we can continuously move up the test rankings. You know, it's it's a good looking on my viewers and subscribers. Uh, all the hype, all the hype where West Indies cricket is concerned is in and around the T20 and the ODI squad um, squads and those players aren't really doing anything. Not saying the test team is really dominating and, 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 and setting the world alight but we would have drawn, we, we, we won England the other day. I think we drew with Pakistan if I'm not mistaken and Sri Lanka I think also, I think also so um, those you know we're definitely moving, we're definitely moving. You understand? Um, you know, so if we're able to secure uh, this series, win the series, I mean, we're not going to lose it because we have won the first one. So if we're able to secure the series here, then definitely would be a good look and we would be able to continue to move up the ranking. But yeah, that is basically it, my viewers and subscribers. Going to leave it right here for now. Uh, you definitely know we're going to be going live on and off throughout um, the test match. All right, my peeps, stay blessed. I'm out.